Bala Lake is the largest natural lake in Wales, covering almost five square kilometres. It is crossed by the River Dee, and local legend states that the lake is home to a monster known as Teggy. Well, let's take a look. We went over a weekend, and on the Saturday, the lake was like a mill pond. <coughs> on the Sunday, the wind picked up and provided an interesting trip into and crossing the wind. The wind was constant at 10 to 12 miles per hour around Force 4. Yeah. We parked and launched from the Water Sports Centre. Payment there includes parking and paddling. As I arrived early, I took a short paddle out and enjoyed the bumpy waves. Even the birds struggling to fly in this wind. That was cold. The rock hopper with the newly working skeg did the job. You can see how windy and choppy it was. I'm going to go to the marker. I paddled out to the first marker buoy. As I turned back, the waves and wind were really hitting against the kayak. So some of these waves are catching me now, so I might try and have a little mini surf. Oh, nearly. Maybe this one. Yay! There we go. Oh, no. And it's still got me. Still pulling me. Nice. Here's another one. So even on pretty limited conditions, you can still have fun. With the group, two kayakers and a paddleboarder, we paddled up the right hand side of the lake for a couple of kilometres. Yeah, I think the rain's come in. Okay. I think the rain might be coming, look. Yeah, I think it might be. Keeping the kayak pointing into the wind made for the easiest progress. It's very scenic, although the light kept dropping as the clouds closed in. The mountains in the distance were often covered in cloud. Good. Turning left, we paddled across the lake. The wind was now blowing from our right and had most of the kayak to push against. Progress was slower and we decided to angle the kayak slightly up lake to compensate for the wind. This worked really well. The return leg to shore was with the wind behind us, which of course made for an easy paddle. The waves, although smaller than earlier in the day, still provided a few catchy surf waves. This is a very weird boat to surf. When I've surfed it on the sea, you, you, the whole of the, almost half the front end is out of the water. Whoop. All in all, a great day out and we all enjoyed ourselves. <laughs>